Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of First 15. Today, we're checking out Heroes Reborn Gemini. Now, this is a video game that ties in with the Heroes Reborn uh, TV series, the, the reimagining of an older TV series that actually tried to do superheroes back when every, the closest we had to superheroes were the X-Men and Black Leather before we even got any chance of seeing the yellow spandex. So, yeah, this caught me a little bit off guard. It was available for cheap in the American PSN sales, so I thought, you why not have to give it a try? Alex? Yep, 99.9%. .9 then why are we sneaking up on it? Better safe than sorry, right? You're not getting cold feet, are you? Not even a bit. Okay, then. Follow me. This way. So it's a little bit of echoey. Up and over. Hey, check this out. We can get through here. Okay, maybe this one time I was recording it, I actually had the mic on and caused there to be a little bit of a feedback issue with the audio. But yeah, this actually It looks like a typical Unreal Engine style kind of like first personer where the way they're actually setting it up. Everything before that is a total blank. So Lady had an accident when she was twelve. And she's meant to have been here before? What? Oh, <laughs> that makes sense. So uh, make me look so I can actually check the which way they, they want me to do up or down. You see it in the oh, That's really? probably one of the and clever ways exactly? to actually um, do qua Eskimos calibrations. In, uh, uh, Greenland? <laughs> Alex, you know I can always tell when you're making things up. Okay, okay, guilty as charged. I just know how important finding out about your parents is to you. You seem kind of nerved out. How could I not be? I'm really curious I've to know whether or not these are actually main characters in the TV life. series. If that was the case, this would be quite interesting, but obviously Heroes Reborn didn't do that well. Um, I think it got a season, did it? <laughs> did it even get a full season before it was yanked off the air again? So the company you work for bought this place? What was it before? A uh, wilderness reserve of some sort, apparently? wants to turn it into a server farm or something. <laughs> that was such a terrible jump. She just wants to get both arms up in there. Ah, I'm falling. Office was trying to get in contact with former employees. I saw their names on the HR manifest. Fair enough. Hmm. Well, obviously we're going to have to start trespassing to get into this place. <laughs> I can't stand the way he jumps. <laughs> it is proper kind of. Like both arms up in the air. Is that actually like a parkour thing? Is that actually like the reason why he's doing it? He's trying to look cool and French. Right, so obviously we're going to break into what appears to be a lab or an industrial space of some sort. So, I haven't, I haven't really got the context for this because it jumps so quickly in the very beginning. Obviously, these are two friends girl wants to know where her parents were or where she came from and this place has a link to it uh, probably a backstory to Heroes Reborn so or just a couple glasses. of side things that they do a bunch of Renatus employees will pick the field test Renatus just don't blog about them or anything or I'll get so fired and then sued and then who knows what hey what are friends for if not to keep secrets all right cool. well that's kind of cool um since you google glass for us in the future totally. I'd got all the same features as a next-gen smartphone. Is it just me, or does it remind me a wild lot video. of the Mirror's Edge um, kind of Whoa. overview oh, kind of like system they have before they hack it to so make it only show for runners like stuff? Check this. Look at me for a few seconds. Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> have I looked at you too long? Apparently you glitched like a motherfucker. That was terrifying. It links to the cloud and searches photo and video data from social media accounts. Uses facial recognition to determine who you're looking at. Okay, that's even more terrifying than you actually got you out. Trust me, Renata's corporation is all about saving the world from itself. <laughs> it's okay as long as Big Brother is, is not paying attention. Doing good is good business. Check this out. Just doing good is good business. So essentially, the Google acronym of Do No Evil. Kind of freaking amazing. Kind of fucking terrifying, but obviously going to be useful whenever tracking enemies in the Wii well. <laughs> Stay on target. Oh shit! <laughs> you said this place was deserted. It looks like it should be deserted. If we hide, they may not notice us. Get down. 
Uh, <laughs> give me the controls them. for how to get down. They're coming right at us. So, sneaky sneaky. Well, obviously I've already scanned them so I can and see the guy making his way. Our so if we go... Alright. So the whole point is, it just keeps on in between me and him. SQL, we're still hunting ghosts this down way. here. Step lightly. Roger that. Hunting ghosts. Over here. Obviously they can't hear him at all. The world's worst soldiers, really? <laughs> okay. I think we're far enough away. Come on. Hey, <laughs> Jester in the right direction. Fucking hell, he can go take off like a bullet. That guy can sprint. Maybe it is Parker. Maybe that's the reason why he can sprint so fast. Who are He's like those guys? super used to running like a motherfucker. I don't know, but they aren't Renata suits, that's for sure. I do like this way of carrying the dialogue in the bottom left corner, almost like a text message conversation. Oh, Works for me. Gotta be a better way to do the this. games could actually pull that off more often with that kind of overlay. They won't see us up there. If they have at least the excuse for this. Alex, wait. Where are you? Seriously? You're just gonna keep going? Yeah, well, why not? You're already, uh, already well past um, the point of illegal. I guess we don't have much of a choice here. No, and record the whole thing while you're at it, because, I mean, that's the whole point of Google Glass. Let's get ourselves up here. Climby, climby, climby time. So, is there going to be many kind of, like, uh, first-person jumping puzzles in this? Um, that's all. It's not, it doesn't pull off very well in nearly every game it's attempted in. But... Obviously, maybe this is kind of like this is post Mirror's Edge game before the first, uh, like after the first one, but before the new one came out. So maybe they kind of like took a little bit of them board because they obviously kind of like got the idea of the the auto climb. Whenever you get close enough to leads, the hands will pull yourself up. So they covered that at least. Wait a second. Whoa, wait. What was that? Shiny. All right. Pair of dog tags. How many soldiers did this place employ? So that's how you find secrets. Here. They'll have a little glittery glue of some sort around them. Hmm. Need to jump the gap. Shouldn't be too hard. Yeah, yeah. Games, don't look down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. Let's come right after you. Okay, Boom! Your turn. You realize this is crazy. Yeah, I mean, see, also, perfect example. Transitive property, you are crazy. You should come visit me sometime. I could show you around to some places that I know you'd like. Visit? I mean, I've Man, got good friends and all I'm of right them. here, dude. Like you. I have to go yeah, visit you whenever we're actually going to do this kind of weird shit. Quality time together. Are we really doing? I guess we're doing this. <laughs> I just didn't give her enough time to even comment on it. Are we really do? Oh my God, we're doing it! <laughs> we should be clear of those guys in no time. Let's see what you got. Hey, follow me over. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops! Maybe that roof wasn't built for two. I don't know. Cassandra, can you hear me? Yep, yeah, I can hear you fine. Say something. I'm okay. It just oh, got the wind knocked out of me. It can't hurt. Just fell four <laughs> stories. Landed rebar. Apparently, I'm Lara Croft. I can keep moving. Ugh. Oh no! Oh, oh there we go. We're in trouble. So obviously, this is going to become a thing. Uh, he's going to get taken. I'll try to run away. Please, don't hurt me. We didn't know anybody was here. Oh God! Oh damn! Sweep the room. Make sure he was alone. Oh no! No! Base. Confirm potential Stop. Don't, over. don't come over here, please. No! Please, no! Oh! Whoa. What? Right. What so this makes happened? absolute sense and fun. Where? Awesome. So where? yeah, where? this is the kind of basic game mechanics where you different? transport from timeline to timeline. Well, not timeline to timeline, but past, before future, future out. to past. So this is obviously like the the gym before it was collapsed. Wow. Nice. Let's see. There you go. You got your bubble view for following wow. after. So as long as I can. All right. So I look and watch, and I can see. Him? Two timelines at once, so I see the peripheral vision of one and it's see a spotlight of another. Please, for example, go. I'm about to walk into a door, I'm sure, here, and I see where the door like is. They don't see yep, or hear see. Me. That's exactly it. Why is this Obviously, at least I've got another way to go. Is it the fall? 
Vent crawling, 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 vent crawling, oh hi. I need to find Alex. And if I can look through time, maybe I can okay. spot auto him. door. Why auto door? Um, is there somewhere? There they are. Oh, shit. <laughs> he just walked straight past me. So... I'll get you out of this, Alex. And then through that way, but that door is not closed in this timeline. So I can't get in there. Right. So obviously this door was open for a reason. I don't know why. Um, is there something in here I need to see? Or like a hole? Can I shut off the power in that timeline? No. Alright, they're still there. Can't get any further. Need to find another way in. Not the vent, that's where I came in. That one's also locked. God damn it, I hit timelines where things are locked. I don't think it was a generator either. Right. Skipping ahead. So, guys and gentlemen, and I've actually, just, if what, what essentially happened was there, I took forever to try and get my way through the puzzle. It was just a bit of a climby, climby time. But I wanted to jump back in again whenever we had a different power. We have telekinesis, man! But the power to kill a yak from 100 yards away with mind bullets! That's telekinesis, Kyle. How about the power? What are you doing down here? To move you. <laughs> it's just oh shit, that didn't take him down. Um, all right. Probably the best move. He's still wandering around. Yeah, he is. Okay. Is this where I need to go? Oh no, I need to get through that door. So. So I can't get in there, so I probably need to take this guy out to actually be able to get any further. Hold on, I can try to use the GPS on your glasses. Hey. I just sent you a nav waypoint. On my All right, way. cool. We'll do. And Alex, it's good to hear your voice again. Right, come on. Okay, I can't go any further backward that way because it's a wall. Okay. Um. Wow. Is that? Ooh. <laughs> so he, one guy was actually behind the door in one timeline, and another guy. Ah, uh, yeah. He, he did spot me, so he went out for a wander. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Gesundheit. That's just a lot of dust in this timeline. So bubbles, bubbles, bubbles everywhere. Searching, searching, searching. Alright, so essentially I can just follow along. It, it feels very, very comfortably linear. Uh, th th I'm not going to get lost wandering around as long as I actually just kind of like follow the next room that's open and then there's a way to get out of each puzzle okay yep and through that one and then back again is there anybody there no just carrying around in this thing with me oh shit boom oh that's you dying <laughs> oh it really doesn't sound nice whenever they bounce off the wall. It's like a proper, uh, and then you see them just fold over themselves. Not good, man. Not good at all. All right, I'm having too much fun with this. Stop buttering the wall with that man. I should leave him alone. He's definitely dead anyway. Bounce off the wall that many times. Oh shit. Okay, so there is another guy to grab here. Well, in the different timeline, so I need to grab a weapon from this room. Well, can I just leave? Nope, no, that's not that way. So it's a locked door. It's a locked door conundrum, and I need to wake my way through. And there's guys on this side of the timeline. Where is he? Mm. Oh, there he is. Sweet. Okay, so. Table, no, too heavy. I'll do the job. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Hey, buddy! Bye-bye! Oh, that looks like a really comfortable... Oh, okay, he's still alive. <laughs> okay, he's not alive. Is he in the roof? Brilliant. Okay, so it definitely doesn't unlock. Oh, crap! <laughs> um, yeah, gonna throw someone on his head. Okay. 
He's gone. Fair enough. Oh, shit! Ugh. Um, um, um. Right, get out of the way. I'm going through this hole. <laughs> Well, at least it let me through the hole in the wall. That was close enough. Uh, obviously, that guy went into the other room, missed me, and then I teleported in, and then he spotted me. So, uh, at least I made it out of the room okay without dying. Safe enough. It's all good. It's all good. Tell me you're somewhere in here. I wish. I'm still quite a ways further ahead. I'm sending you a new waypoint. Hurry. They could be back any minute. Okay, I got an old terminal up and running. Maybe I can find more info on your parents. Go you, hacker chap. So, different timeline. At least I can make it through doors. There we go. Oh, okay. Okay. New powers. And fire. And fire. Oh. Looks like I'm holding him by his throat that time. Proper force choking him. So yeah, this is um, kind of like a time mechanic that I have. So not just do I have the time jump, I also have time slow. Um, it alters physics a little bit, makes everything drop or move faster or slower. So I imagine I'm probably going to need it to get through this bit right here. Yeah, we need it to get through these um, bands. Oh, God, that, that does not look appetizing at all. Uh, so, okay. I can't make it through. The, oh, ow, ow, ow. I can't make it through the grating. So, yeah, obviously. There we go. There's the space to work my way through. As okay as I can be. Hmm. You sound like maybe you're in shock. It's a bit um, mad because I, essentially, well, can he talk to me through timelines or does he only speak to me whenever I reappear back in this one? Which is also terrifying. Because otherwise, if he can talk to me in this timeline, it means that they've eventually created trans-dimensional goggles. Oh! <laughs> it does not look appetizing. Okay, so time for me to make it through. There we go. Problem solved. So, in this timeline, everything's shut down and dead. There's no walkway, so I need this walkway. But where can I go after this? There's nowhere. Ah, oh, it must be just somewhere I can land underneath. Hopefully. Bueller? Bueller? Yeah. Alright, safe enough. I was a wee bit worried there for a second. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, easily climb. Alright, so there we go. That's how you switch from uh, step to step. And up again. You can get around that one. Oh, and just slow it down. See if it's sound. Oh, well, no, 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 no! Oh. I didn't think that through. Didn't check it beforehand. <laughs> Error pulse not found. That's a nice warning. <laughs> If I ever see that warning on my new Google glasses uh, or on my VR headset, I'll know it's just like, that's it. That's the end of time. I've, I've done myself in. It's over. It's like, I, I've literally just plugged myself into the web and I'm just watching my own body decay at that point. All right, so do, how far back does it send me here? All right, so it's just sending me back to the last kind of like climby bit. That's not too bad. See if they're fairly quick and regular in this. Um... So I'm not too concerned, level-wise. Alright. Oh, no, I didn't lift you up properly. There we go. Come on. There. Oh, oh, oh. that one must have taken off his head. Yep. Climby, 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 climb. Alright, so don't... Alright, so it is there. Sweet. So, don't fall. Yeah. Fun time. You can't see me. Guess what? 
You're coming with me, buddy! Oh, just lift him! Hey! Hey, flying dude! Dead flying dude! Why don't you fly anymore? Ooh, is that his cap? Sweet. So this is all must be inside rock. So there's literally no light or no sign of anything. So I must stay on this timeline. Oh! Ow! Busted ankle, but worth it. No, oh, we're at least more You're stuff to find. Pinehurst. Pinehurst was the company from the paper company from the uh, original oh, series, wasn't it? Oh, <laughs> so I can't get out of the way. Could I catch these? Oh, nice catching bullets. Awesome. Try it. Fire, you prick. Oh, there you go, and shot it right back at you. <laughs> And fire. Okay, this is extremely useless. <laughs> Your rifle is useless against me. Safety's off. Ah! That must be terrifying to watch them just go like wave their hand and literally disappear from in front of you. You're like, oh my god! Ah, ah. This is brilliant. I'm actually, I'm really enjoying this game just because of the amount of powers that they drop at you very, very quickly. I'm sure this would actually get very frustrating whenever there's like a, a, a five-part puzzle that would just have over the top. And I, I don't want to, I want to actually sit down and properly play through this because I had to skip ahead to show a little bit earlier on. Guys, this is a Heroes Reborn Gemini on the PlayStation 4. It's actually a really enjoyable game. It's just the mechanics and the puzzling in it works really well. It's a bit like Portal with a little bit of Half-Life thrown in for measure. It's... This is great. I, well worth the cost of entry. Well, guys, I mean, this has been a, a first look for Fast Teacher of Skin. I'm going to try and take this jump. And if I make it, we'll keep on playing. So, let's rock and roll. I'll see you later. Bye-bye. Oh, shit. Jump. <laughs>